Top 10 Biggest Sea Monsters Ever Welcome back to the Magnetic Flux. Today we are back with some exciting and thrilling list of Top 10 Biggest Sea Monsters Ever. Do real sea monsters actually exist, or is it all just the direction about the human's monstrous face? Okay, it was just a joke, because big sea monsters exist for real in this world. The world knows very little about the oceans and sea. People have focused more on the space research than exploring the sea and finding out its deadliest monsters ever. Touring around is quite safe these days, but still, some people have a serious fear from adventures and trying out new things. And as some venturesome places are way more perplexing than others, it can be challenging even for the daring adventurous people. From all around the world, the mountain ranges to the space, the oceans are the most neglected ones. Don't forget to hit subscribe and click the bell icon to get notified of the new content. Now, let's move forward to our video and take a look at Top 10 Biggest Monsters of Sea Ever, which can help us know better about the ocean life and the scariest sea creatures residing in it. Following is the list of Top 10 Biggest Sea Monsters Ever. Release the Kraken! Number 10 is Japanese Spider Crab. Now at the 10th number of the list of top 10 biggest ever monsters living in the sea is the Japanese spider crab. You might be wondering why it is even called Japanese's. Do only Japanese eat it or what? The Japanese spider crab is an arthropod with a leg of length 12 feet long and these legs can keep growing without any increase in its carapace. It belongs to the same phylum as other spiders and insects. To continue the list of largest creatures, we choose this because it is also the largest in all anthropods and crabs family. They can decorate or change the appearance of their shells as a sign of fear or danger, and they can camouflage. Number 9 is Ocean Sunfish. By the name of this ocean sunfish, you might be thinking it's something as bright as the sun, <laughs> but it's not like that. Ocean Sunfish is also known as Mola Mola another cool name. It is known for its heavy weight in all bony fish. This fish is measured 10.82 feet long without any tail, and it weighs surprisingly 5,070 pounds. Ocean fish is known at the number 9 on the list of top 10 biggest sea monsters ever. Global measures are being taken to preserve this beautiful species, such as ban on whaling, as there are many other sea factors affecting the sea creatures, such as climate changes, as they impact greatly on the animals in the sea. Number 8 is Oarfish. Oarfish is on the number 8 in the list of top 10 biggest sea monsters ever. Oarfish can be seen in its old shape of dragon or is known as sea serpent. Oarfish are long. Now, you might be thinking, huh, it's the quality of almost every creature that we have discussed so far. <laughs> but the exclusive feature is that the oarfish is the longest bony fish and has the quality to live under the 3,300 feet of water. The sad part is that these beautiful fish can be seen very rarely on the surface of water and mostly loves to live under deep waters. Oarfish is also known as ribbon fish as it is 26 feet in length. Number 7 is Giant Pacific Octopus. The Giant Pacific Octopus is known as the biggest cephalopod of all the sea creatures. This octopus can spread its body radically over the length of more than 32 feet. The most distinctive feature of this Giant Pacific Octopus is that it can camouflage itself when needed, and thus it changes its color of reddish brown. <laughs> yes, it is cool enough to see an octopus changing its color as the threat of getting preyed. The giant Pacific octopus is more intelligent than most of the men out there, <laughs> just kidding. But these octopuses are really smart enough to solve mazes, play around, or even open jars. The aquariums are also a place for the residing of such octopus, and they are designed in a way to enhance their mental ability. This giant Pacific octopus is named so because it can be found through the Pacific Ocean. Number six is giant squid. The giant squid won the prize in the contest of being the longest cephalopod ever. <laughs> you might be thinking, why every fish is known as the largest of its kind? It is because these are the main and scariest known sea monsters. 
Mostly, the scientists have noticed the giant squid in its natural habitat and were seen in deep sea in 2012 for the first time ever in the scientists' history. This credit was given to the Japanese National Science Museum. The tentacles of the giant squid is long enough to catch its loser food. Yes, I'm talking about its prey. The length of its tentacles exceeds up to 30 feet almost. This is known creature in the world of sea monster tales, and it is used by many parents as stories to make their little ones sleep. Number five is basking shark. The oceans are filled with the second largest fish, which is known as the basking shark. It can extend to the length of a school bus. Haha, <laughs> stop imagining a school bus with a shark on it. By the way, such an entertainment. The overall length of this shark is over 40 feet and is quite long. The weight of this basking shark is between 8,000 pounds. Mostly, the basking shark is found with its snout and widely opens in the ocean surface. These are known as the gentle and calm giants, and their basic food is the eggs or larvae of fish and plankton mostly in the water. So big! Number four is whale shark. As we know, whale shark is known as the most beautiful and the largest fish in the sea, yet it is also considered as a majestic giant creature. They are very playful species of whales as they play with other species under the water and also with the people swimming there. If you run into a whale shark under the water, it's like you are going to wake up a sleeping baby. <laughs> they get really messy if you try to entangle with them. There are exclusive marks and lines on the shark body that make them different and unique from others. Number three is sperm whale. Sperm whale is most known in its largest size in the list of largest toothed predators and the largest toothed whales as it is 80 feet in length. Its funniest and interesting fact is that it can be as tall as an eight-story long building. Now, don't start imagining a whale on a building. <laughs> its clicking can be as loud as the sound of rifle heard within a feet distance. Its clicking call is measured as 230 decibels under the water, but 170 decibels on the land. The size of its brain is almost 20 pounds and is considered as the largest brain of an animal in the world. These sperm whales were the basic hunt in 18th to 20th century and were much useful in making candles, lamp oil, soap, and many other basic applications. Now, you might be thinking about that soap which came out of a fish. <laughs> it's absolutely possible. Number two is blue whale. Everybody is familiar with the blue whale and its beauty. It is the largest known existing animal ever and can even outsize the dinosaurs. And the funniest yet the interesting fact about this whale are that its heart is of the same size as the car. What do we do now? We use whale's heart as a car? Absolutely no. You can detect its heartbeat even from two miles away. So its heartbeat can be a sign for you to run away and save your life. We can imagine the weight of this whale just by looking at the size of its heart. The exact weight of blue whale is 441,000 of pounds. Blue whale isn't even a baby, even if it's a baby. <laughs> They are fully grown animals when they are even just born. These whales are very precious, as in 20th century, they went almost near extinct because of the uncertain commercial whaling. Number one. Number one is lion's mane jellyfish. After the blue whale, the lion's mane jellyfish is ranked at the top of the list if we talk about the length, as it's the longest. Like the long medusa zoa, this creature has long tentacles that can reach up to the length of 120 feet. Their extraordinary attachments or limbs make them distinctive from other creatures in the sea and are also vulnerable to the predators. These tentacles can enhance its beauty, but mind that where there is beauty, there is a trap. <laughs> so the tentacles can get the jellyfish trapped in the debris and can make its predator easy to catch it as the tentacles take a longer time to contract. But jellyfish can also be a prey because why not? First, they tend to cuddle with the prey and then pull it towards itself and eat it sweetly. They mostly depend on a variety of creatures that live in the sea, but also their own kind. Hope you enjoyed the video. 
Don't forget to hit like and subscribe and comment down below which sea monster you were most scared of.